Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I have something super exciting for you. How to automate your life with Canva just in minutes. Whether you are an educator or a business professional or just someone looking to streamline everyday tasks, this video is for you. If you are spending a lot of time on repetitive tasks like creating certificates, marketing materials, invitations, then you're using Canva wrong. Imagine saving countless hours by automating this task using data from sources like Google Sheets, CSV files, Excel, Airtable, or your CRM. Sounds amazing, right? By the end of this video, you will know exactly how to use Canva along with these data sources to create documents effortlessly. Plus, all the Canva templates we use will be available in the description below. Before we get started, please make sure to hit the subscribe button, give the video a thumbs up and click the notification bell so you don't miss any of our future content. Now we're going to log into our Canva account. If you don't have an account yet, please pause the video, create one and then resume the video. I have one and I'm going to just uh, log into my account. Canva. Yes. So I will log in with my account. I will continue with my Google account. Yeah. Okay. Continue. There we go. Next, we need to design a certificate and I already designed one. Let me show you. Okay, so this is a template as you see, and here we have the, the award, this is the rank first place. So uh, we want this to be dynamic, okay? So we, we will have a data, and in data we have all the rankings, we'll have all the names. So this, should, this will be dynamic as well, this will be dynamic as well. The date also dynamic, and here as well. So the rest is going to be static they won't change okay so um, this is the template that we're going to use next uh, let me show you the data that I prepared here in the Google Drive looks like we have some celebrities in our school we have Magnus Carlson, Hikaru, Jan Napomniachi, Wesley So, Anishkiri so these are these are the rankings and the school name is the same and we have also the date here and now what we need to do is we need to download this as a, as a csv file i'm going to go to file go to download and i will select comma separated values values okay let me hit download so it's it's downloaded now we're back in our certificate template. What we're going to do is we're going to upload the CSV file that we downloaded from our Google Sheet. And then we're going to connect data to these place holders here. And now I will, on the sidebar, I will click Apps. And then scroll down, click Bulk Create. As you see here, we have two options. The first one is Enter Data Manual. Okay, so you can enter data manually if you want. You can add more columns. You can even add images. Okay, you can click uh, images and you can add them. But we're not going to use this option as we downloaded our file. We have a nice table and we will simply uh, bulk upload. And before doing that, I would like to remind that we can upload Excel file, data in Excel file, CSV and TSV file. Now let's click upload file okay so in download folder i have the csv file that we downloaded let me open it so uh, there we go we have uh, our table uh, with the column name with uh, holding all the participants names their positions rankings school names and date so next thing we're going to do is we will connect uh, this data to the placeholders here first of all I will start with the ranking okay so because this will be dynamic and the data will come from the uh, uh, table here so let's click 
connect data so the, I will be using position a column so I will select position next the name also will be dynamic and will coming from name column and we also have a uh, rank here position here it will get from uh, position column and the date will come from date and the school name will come from the school okay finally we also have a date here it will come from date okay so now we connected our data with the placeholders so next thing we're going to do is i'm going to click continue okay so we have a button here generate five designs it's five because there were five uh people five participants it could have been 100 you know it could you know whatever number you have it is also possible so right now i will click generate five and see what happens so we have a file generated with bulk one certificate uh, certificate you know this is our original certificate and there's a new uh, file let's see what we have so we have first place magnus second place hikaru and third place Jan, just like in our data table you know everything uh, we created we generated S certificate for all the participants just at one go okay so that's how you do it congratulations and you have just automated certificate creation we also had a, had a bit of fun along the way uh, so if you want you can go ahead and you can download and you can print it you can share with uh, other people there are many options to choose from and um, so we will continue with the next automation task now let's tackle automating report cards. With the end of school year, managing grades and report cards can be daunting task for teachers. So let's see how we can simplify this process using Canva. Now I'm back in Canva with the report card template. As you see, we have the student name, grade, and teacher name. We have attitude here, and then we have academic uh, performance of the student. We have teacher's remark. Teacher's remark will go here and we have some additional notes and they will go here. So all this data, all this information for each student is available in this report card data. Okay, as you see, we have some famous uh, celebrities uh, in our class and we have the students grades and the class teachers so we have their behavior behavioral uh performance behavior performance their academic performance uh, here and we have teachers remark for each student and then we also have note for each student as well so let's go back to our report card what we are going to do is we are going to again download this data as a csv file okay and it is downloaded now I will go back here and I will do the same process and uh, from apps I need to click bulk upload okay so I will uh, connect data right now uh, uh, yeah first I need to upload it so here we have the report card okay so I'm going to connect name with the name placeholder grade with the uh, class and teacher's name with the teacher's name so i'm going to pause the video and connect all of the data and then resume afterwards welcome back now that i connected my uh, data to the template to all placeholders now we can go ahead and generate our certificates so i have 10 students in the data so i'll uh, click generate 10 designs now our report cards are ready so we have as you see we have 10 report cards we have 10 pages they're all ready let's check each one and uh, yeah we have tom felton's we have um, bonnie Wrights. so we have all of them and they're ready in no time now let's move on to automating employer recognition badges recognizing your team's hard work can boost morale and productivity 
but creating individual badges can be time consuming. Let's see how Canva can simplify this process. We are back again in Canva and I'm going to select employee badge uh, template. And here, as you see, uh, my template is ready. Uh, Elon Musk being em employee of the month. All right. So what we're going to do is uh, this time, instead of downloading our data and uploading it as a CSV file, I'm going to do something different. Let's go to apps and bulk create, enter data manually. I will just go here and I will paste it. You see, I copied uh, my data and I just paste it here. And, but what is missing uh, here is that we need to have image for each employee as well. And I'm going to add image column here. And okay, this is good. Let me save it. But I need to upload images first, okay? So in order to upload images, you see in the sidebar, you will see uploads, okay? Here, uh, we need to upload our images. I already have um, in my local drive the employee uh, images of the employees. Okay, so here we go. So we have, I will just select all of them. And now they're uploaded. So now I will go back to apps, then bulk create. And from here, enter data manually. And now I can upload, I can put my images here. Let me click the symbol here. And this is Elon Musk. Uh, this one is Tim Cook. And this one is Sunder. And then finally we have Jeff Bezos. Okay. All right. So my data table is ready. Okay. So uh, now you know uh, how we connect this and I'm going to connect the image to images. All right. So again, I will just continue and then hit generate button. Okay. Our badges are ready. Elon Musk employee of the month. Probably he will get a Tesla as a, as a reward. Uh, all right. So we have here a food name, which is recipe column. We have ingredients. We have instructions coming from instructions column. And we also have author coming from here. And then let's continue. Generate 10 designs. Okay, it's ready. So 10 pages cookbooks uh, is ready in no time. And let's check, check them out. We have spaghetti carbonara and with the ingredients, spaghetti eggs, and then instructions and the author name. And here we have apple pie and we have chicken curry. So they're all here and 10 pages and is created in just one minute. So the final automation task is creating travel itineraries. So summer is just around the corner and many of us are planning our next vacation, right? Pla but planning a trip can be uh, exciting, but also at the same time, it can be overwhelming with all the details involved. So let's see how Canva can help uh, us uh, streamline this process. Okay, I have a template ready with placeholders for uh, destination, date, time, activities, transportation, accommodation and notes now let's uh click continue okay and uh, okay generate 10 designs and our itinerary is ready for every single day okay the first destination is paris it will be july 1st and activities eiffel tower visit transportation information the name of the hotel but uh, the next destination is Rome and activities transportation is walking all right and then we have Tokyo and then sushi definitely is a is a must that's it you have just automated the creation of detailed travel itineraries 
making trip planning a breeze and there you have it five powerful ways to automate your life with canva in just 15 minutes from certificates and report cards to employee badges family recipe books and travel itineraries canva makes it all super easy and efficient let's quickly recap what we have covered automating certificates for school events simplifying grade management with automated report cards creating personalized employee recognition badges compiling beautiful family recipe books and finally planning detailed travel itineraries effortlessly remember all the canva templates we use in this video are available in the description below so try these techniques and see how much time you can save if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and comment below with your thoughts or any questions you had. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more great content. Thanks for watching and until next time, keep creating and stay efficient.